Hey, it's Michael. Here's four things for athletes to make your sport better, make your life better. Check it out. Choose action over anxiety. It's very easy for athletes to worry about the outcome, worry about an upcoming game or competition. Instead of worrying, turn that energy into some sort of an action. It could be a very small action. Maybe it's just having a talk with your coach or a teammate about your concern. But do something. Maybe it's training more. Maybe it's training less. But do something. Don't just worry. Worry is the illusion of control. It tricks your mind into thinking that you're being vigilant about the future when in fact you're just not doing anything. So translate that anxiety into action. That'll be a game changer. Do something. One small action, one big action, whatever it is. Starts by talking with someone, getting your head cleared out about those worries. Choose inspiration, not comparison. It's very easy for athletes to compare themselves to others or even compare themselves to a previous performance. You don't want to do that. You want to seek inspiration from others. Someone who's beaten you or a team who's beaten you. Think about the great things that they did and take a page from their book, but don't take their whole book. You are not them. You are you. So seek inspiration from others, but don't fall into the comparison trap where you beat up on yourself, think less of yourself, and think that other people got it all figured out. They don't. They've got their problems too. Use inspiration, not comparison. Choose purpose over pleasure. Throughout the day, look at the choices that you make. Are they more pleasure-driven or are they more purpose-driven? By pleasure-driven, I mean hedonistic pleasures that only serve their own purpose momentarily, like eating a piece of chocolate cake late at night when it's going to keep you up, uh, hitting the snooze button, skipping training, Netflix binging, drinking too much alcohol, staying up late, the kinds of things that you know are kind of fun in the moment, but if you're an athlete, they're really going to bite you for the next couple of days. So start to tweak the needle in the direction of purposeful activities as opposed to just momentary pleasure activities. So purposeful is it brings joy, value to you and others. It builds character. It's going to build you up and not tear you down, take you back. So focus more toward purposeful activities throughout the day. Choose mission over self. Focus on your higher purpose in your sport. Why are you doing your sport? What happens when you win? What happens when you lose? What do people see? What is the impact that you have on the world? Write down a mission statement if you haven't already. It's really going to help you. Think about really what happens when you perform. In essence, you're a performer. You're an artist, really. So what impact do you have on the world? How do you want to make your sport better? How do you want to spread positive vibes in your sport and in the world? Think about that. Write down the ways that your sport actually does that. And we often don't think about that, but it's really true. Find your mission statement, something that really motivates you, and focus less on yourself, less on your ego, less on the money you're making or not making, less on your results, and much more on the deeper, higher purpose of your sport. That's going to give you a deep reservoir of strength when you really need it.